service a water cooler dear viewers so far we have seen all the specifications and performances of a bottle cooler now let us study some service details of a water cooler tools required pipe wrench screw driver cutting plier wire stripper thermometer stop watch tong tester and vacuum cleaner equipment bottle cooler materials clean cloth soap solution clean water teflon tape insulation tape terminal clip hose clips starting relay starting capacitor overload protector enamel paint paint brush emery sheet pvc insulated copper wire clean the water tank and sheet metal parts switch off the appliance and remove the plug from the socket close the inlet water valve drain the water in the tank by opening the faucet or through the remote parts at the back side make sure that the water in the tank is completely drained out open the water cooler door and clean the inner surface of the water tank using a wet clean cloth and keep open the door for 10 minutes clean the exterior sheet metal surface with a clean cloth check the water valves make sure the water tank is clean and dry partially open the inlet valve slowly check the water flow into the tank through the float valve check the operation of the float valve by lifting its lever with ball manually check the water flow inside the tank is stopped hold the ball by hand and feel the weight if there is a leak in the ball the weight will be more due to the water trapped inside replace float ball if necessary check any water leak on the pipe joints near the valves if any leak is found arrest it by tightening the valve with pipe using pipe wrenches allow the water flow inside the tank till it reaches maximum level ensure no more water flow after it reaches maximum limit due to float valve is closed clean the refrigeration parts and components ensure the appliance is disconnected from electrical power supply open the door of the condensing unit by unscrewing its screws clean the compressor body using clean cloth clean the refrigerant pipelines clean the condenser fins area by blowing the air using an air blower clean the fan blade using a dry clean cloth replace defective parts check the water pipeline for leaks and loose joints replace water tubes hose clips if found defective replace mounting bolts nuts and washers of compressor and fan motor replace fan blade if it is defective replace the compressor spare part like starting relay capacitor and olp is found defective check leak on the refrigerant lines take some quantity of soap solution with clean water in a bowl apply the soap solution on the joints of refrigerant tubes using a sponge check the refrigerant tubes have any leaks make sure there is no leak in the tubes dear viewers at the end of this five exercises you have learned to clean water tank and sheet metal parts to clean water pipes and water valves to clean refrigeration parts and components to replace defective parts and components and to check the leak on refrigerant lines with this we have come to an end of these exercises